The purpose of a factory is to manufacture products and create value. Thus, it is essential to merge value stream and layout during planning. But how does it work? Let's see it in the video. Let's explain the merging of value stream and layout with a short story. The CEO of your company decides to outsource a production area of your factory to a consumer market. The suitable real estate at the new location is already rented. You are a young engineer in your company. The CEO is very pleased with your work because you have pushed the development of the 3D layout. He wants you to take over the planning for the relocation. You have rebuilt the 3D layout of the production area based on the 2D layout, but you have no practical experience with layout planning yet. But you immediately agree. It's only a small area. It should be pretty easy. Here we go. You take the 3D models of the production area and start building the new layout. The layout is actually not that big, but you realize very quickly that there are still endless possibilities to arrange the machines, plants, workstations, and warehouse equipment, and you get lost in the details. Time passes faster and faster without any result, and you get a bit restless. Therefore, you ask your colleagues to help you. However, each colleague has a different professional focus, and the tips and suggestions are very different and do not help you. Time passes faster and faster, and you despair and resign. Your friend from your studies suggests that you should focus on the products and the manufacturing processes and take the value stream into account when planning the layout. That is, simply put, align the layout with the purpose of the factory. Early the next morning, you start to implement the new idea. You acquire the production processes for the product families and enter them into your layout planning system. With the integration of the product and process data, you have connected the layout with the value stream and can recognize the relationships between the layout objects based on the material flow. The next step, the actual layout planning, is now quite simple. The value stream gives you exactly the orientation you were lacking at the beginning. On the one hand, you can recognize which objects belong together on the basis of the material flow connections. On the other hand, arrangement algorithms give you suggestions as to the order in which you should arrange the objects in the layout. In the beginning, you were disoriented. Now, you just have to arrange everything according to the colors. Suddenly, everything is very easy. Now you not only have a final planning solution, but you can also show the improvements and potential savings compared to the original, historically grown layout. You now know how to proceed with the layout planning. Your boss is extremely satisfied with your work and is very happy to have you as an employee.